Welcome to the Office of Academic Technology Blackboard Video Tutorials. In this video tutorial, we'll show you how to create an entry within the blog tool in Blackboard. The content of the blog usually will appear right here in this center section. We're going to use this uh, case study project in an EDU 624 course shell to demonstrate how you create a new entry. So content right here in the middle. On the right sidebar here is your navigation and in the upper right hand corner is a question mark icon and that indicates help documentation. So how do you create a new entry? Well you can just go right to the right sidebar and click the new entry link. When you do this it, it opens up a new page a dialog box where you can create a title for your entry and you can put text into your entry. So we're gonna call this new title and then I'm gonna click down here into this box and I can type in words and I can format words with italics, bold, underline and I do this just like in Microsoft Word. This whole area right here um, looks hopefully will look familiar to you has some of the inner workings of Microsoft Word. So I could just select this word italics and I can go ahead and click the I for italics and I could select this and make this bold and I can click this and make this underline. I can do lots of different things with formatting. If I wanted to make this a, a bulleted list I could go up here and click bulleted list and I can go ahead and make uh, all the different formatting decisions I want to and typing in all the words that I want to for my blog post. When I'm finished, right over here and click the Save button and the blog entry is saved. And it shows right here when the blog post was created and the date that was created and who it was created by. And that is how you create a blog post within Blackboard. If you have questions or need more help, contact the Office of Academic Technology. We're online at www.arbor.edu forward slash oat.